Hello, how you doing? Apparently, I'm getting some downloads in the middle of the day and I need to get them out. Um, this one's going to be about an emperor and empress energy. Either you have it or you don't. Either you're striving for it or you're not. And you have to explain something to you. What it takes to be an emperor or the empress is everybody wants the throne, right? Who doesn't? Everybody wants the prestige of being the emperor or the empress. But nobody wants to do the work. And most people understand that to do the work is painful. It's, it's excruciating. That's why most people don't want it. If you, if you gave somebody a slice of what it meant to be the emperor or the empress and what it took to get there, they'd be like, no, I'm, I'm good. I'm just going just gonna to be a serf and be cool with that, right? Don't give a shit. Because you don't see a lot of emperors and empresses walking around on this earth. And there's a reason for it. Because it's hard as hell to get there. And once you do, you don't go back. And you're probably not hanging out with the crowd either. So, I mean, it's a great example of, of empress or emperor energy is Joan of Arc. She was an empress. Her energy was an empress energy. Taking no shit. I mean, talk about one the English gone. Getting downloads from God. Just saying, get your... I mean, when you have knights telling her that she needs to calm down, that she's too bloodthirsty, I mean, she was focused on... I mean, the atrocities that at that, at that time... Talk about low vibration, right? The atrocities that were going on were horrific. And to, I took, to put yourself in her position, right? A lady, a woman at that time. And adversity was just non-existent to this young lady. She was indetermined by anything by her sex by uh, the english army you know she was like undetermined by all her her doubters and you know all the royalty that in the french royalty that were plotting against her because they saw her power and they were like scared of it her popularity so she was like you know internal fighting external fighting and she fought through it she was a badass she was a warrior goddess and that is in the empress energy and that's what you need to focus on and that's what you need to be is that empress or emperor energy take no shit don't tolerate even from yourself because you have to you have to be you can't be the emperor and empress and go around being a dick to people or an asshole or a bitch that's just not how it works you are the person everybody expects to be above that shit and and you are which is that's how you get the status babe you don't go back you don't once you once you get the throne you don't go back and say okay well i'm, I'm cool no, you, you, you attain that vibration, that high vibration status, and it, does, it doesn't leave. It's the way it is forever, which is a beautiful thing. So, and that's why a lot of people don't understand when they try to attack you psychically, that once you attain that high vibration level, it's like you got a shield. You're, you're beyond that. You're so engulfed in the, the universe and God's you know, grace that you can't be touched, period, in the story. So... That's my, that's it. That's what I have to say today. Just, I'm done. Hope you enjoyed. Hope it helps become the emperor, empress of your universe. Universe. And take the high ground and keep it, babe. Love and light. I love you. God loves you. And the universe is still really, really hot on your tail, babe. So have fun with that. Okay. Love you.